This video is intended to teach how to compose the Dynamo script to create aromatic views by using the Modelical Dynamo package notes. Let's assume we have a project consisting of a tower with a basement, ground floor and nine levels. We want to create three types of views for each level, each one with a different view template corresponding to area plans, architecture plans and structure plans. Since the floor plan is very big, it will not fit in the sheets, so we have divided it in four zones by using four scope boxes corresponding to zone A, B, C and D. So we want to create a view for each scope box, from each view template and for each level. If we multiply the 11 levels by 3 view templates per level and 4 scope boxes per view template, that gives us a total of 132 views we need to create. If I wanted to create all these views manually in Revit, I would go to Plan Views, Floor Plan, I would select all the levels, OK, and with this way I would create a floor plan for each level. Now, if I select them all, I can apply a view template, let's say it's for instance the architectural plan template, so each floor plan has the template assigned. I should rename every view with the corresponding template they have been assigned, for instance architectural plan, and then I should duplicate view as dependent in order to separate the floor plan into four zones corresponding to each scope box. I should also rename this view and I should do this operation for the four zones. Now I should repeat these operations for each level and for each view template. It will not only require a tremendous amount of time, but it is possible also that I make any mistakes in this process while creating views or assigning names. That is why we have automatic tools like Dynamo to create all these views automatically. In order to create automatic views, I should go to Dynamo open a new sheet, I'm going to place it in manual, and I should search for the Modelical package, which is the package by Modelical containing the nodes we're going to use for the automatic views creation. Here if I tap Modelical, it will show this node that I can download through here, I already have it in my browser, and the nodes we're going to use are under Views, the Floor Plan with View Template node, and the scope boxes to views. This node creates a floor plan with an assigned view template we're gonna give it. And this one creates views from the assigned scope boxes we give over here. For this node we're also going to use another node by Morelical called get all scope boxes. So if we connect all the views we create over here to the scope boxes, it will create a view with the assigned scope boxes we're gonna give. In this node it gives us all the scope boxes we have in the project. If we hit run, it will say we have four scope boxes. And this node over here it's asking us for levels and for template names. In order to give levels, we're going to tap Categories and we're also going to use all elements of category. In Categories we're going to select the levels This will give us all the levels we have in the project and we're going to connect to our node. And under template names we're gonna write a code block with the 
three different template names we have for the project corresponding to architectural plan, structural plan and area plan. We connect over here. Once this is composed, we have the Dynamo script already to create the automatic views. So as we can see, we have our project here. We have no floor plans created yet. We only have work in progress views corresponding to three views and elevations. And when we hit run, it's going to automatically create 132 views corresponding to each view template for each level and with four zones corresponding to each scope box for each level. So after a few seconds the program is thinking and we can see already here the views have been created. I have my view browser, my project browser organized so we can view the the different views corresponding to the view template, in this case the architectural plan. We have created an architectural plan with four uh, dependent views corresponding to each zone. The same for the area plans with four zones corresponding to each scope box and the same with the structural plan. 